Hey, hey everybody, how you guys doing? Good morning, or almost afternoon for most of you guys. Had to grab some socks too, I need to put some socks on. Forgot to do that and uh, send out my announcements here. So we'll get started here shortly. If you're in chat, let me know. Let me know what your favorite brunch item is. That's why we wanna know. That's the topic for the morning. Also wanna know if you like the lights on or lights off better. Um, kind of looking at it here. Let's see. I don't know, lights up. Oh, I guess I could turn on my kitchen lights. Dirt. That should make things uh, a little less uh, dreary here. Hey, Ash, how you doing, dear? What, uh, what rank are you at now? Excuse me while I try to put on socks standing up. Oh, feet are cold. It's like. 40 something degrees out. Hey, who cares? Yeah, burritos, man. I haven't made breakfast burritos forever. Inspired by Celissa last week making breakfast pizza. I thought about doing that too. Still nine. Hey, that's all right. Nine's pretty good. Uh, you're in the top 10. You'll be able to definitely chip away at uh, Legend pretty soon. I'm going to try to check chat a little bit over here too so I don't have to touch the screen as much and make the, the boopy sounds that I think you guys hear. Um, but yeah, nine's good. I mean, just keep chipping away. Uh, today's the last day of the season, but you know, you get there, you'll get the legend when you get the legend. And you know, once you get to five, it turns into a grind. Uh, but you'll get there. Let's see. All right. What, do you, what, do you, what is your guys' favorite breakfast? That's that's the important thing here, though. Not Hearthstone. What do you guys like to eat? Um, so while you guys are, hey Derp Ward, how you doing, buddy? Hey Vanilla Coffee. I like bacon. I'm actually not doing bacon today, but if you go check out my YouTube, just search uh, Mighty Rye Hearthstone. My very first episode, I made a lot of bacon, Derp Ward. So definitely check that out. You can it. All my cooking videos are a little long, so you know, feel free to fast forward through it as well. Um, Skipperino, Regis Reno Skipperino has been like putting skips in there to once I take like the first bite, because I usually do the social eating too. So definitely check that out as I point this sharp knife at you guys. Uh, so I, I saw pancakes, I think that was uh, Ash that said pancakes. I love waffle, I'm more of a waffle guy than pancakes. Bacon, 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 that is a great choice as well. Again, see my first episode if you didn't already see it. I keep wanting to turn on the light here. It's it's just like natural habit here, but I think I'm assuming this looks a little bit better. If you think it look better with that gross light, let me know. Don't stab us, please. Actually, this this tip wouldn't hurt too bad. This is a this is a actually a steak knife. I used to sell Cutco knives. And it's a really baller steak knife. Like it can cut through leather. Because um, that was actually how we demonstrated um, how powerful it was. Um, I'll show you the sausage we're putting in too. I decided to go sausage today. Uh, I just kind of like that a little bit better with breakfast burritos and I haven't had breakfast sausage in, in forever. So we're going to fry this bad boy up here. Oh, listen to that sizzle. That's the sound of freedom guys. That is the sound of freedom. Ugh. Not communism, freedom. Not terrorism. Definitely not terrorism. Alright, we got... We're just gonna have to get a little dirty here. I washed my hands recently. Actually, I just took a shower. I did a CrossFit workout this morning. It was pretty brutal. That's why we had the late start today. I apologize for that. Also, need my apron. And now, more importantly, I need to catch up and chat here. Burka. Cutco, yes. Yes, you, uh, hey Evan, you know the, you know the drill. We did, had to do that too. We had to take the meat scissors and, and like cut around. Fortunately, I mean, I shouldn't say fortunately. I mean, sales just wasn't for me, but I only did that for a summer before I went to college. And I'm like, ah, I'm going to stop doing this. But they were great knives. Definitely great knives. Dirt Ward says, I have four YouTube links in my clip tray and I don't know what they are. Um, uh, do put them in chat. Um, I might, I might be able to do that. Let me, my laptop is 
brutally slow though, so it'll probably take the full like hour or two or however long it takes us to cook to get through that. Um, so before I throw this other sausage in here, I'm, I always do things in doubles because that's the right thing to do for me. Um, so this is Swaggerty's Farm All Natural Preservative Free Sausage. So it was, you know, a little bit supposedly higher quality sausage. Never used it before. Got it at a place called Fresh Time. Um, I think it's a um, a I think it's a chain, but not like a massive chain. But they have some pretty sweet selection of stuff that I like to eat. Like I, I like to drink kombucha. They have a good selection of that there. They have a good selection of my Yogi tea, which I'll show you what I'm drinking today. Oh boy. All right, let's get this guy into the pool first though. Start breaking up the sausage. All right. Oh yeah, feel the feel this grease. Love it. You're going to my body. I am pretty hungry. I haven't eat. I ate a little bit of a snack today because I was I was gonna pass out if I didn't eat a little something. I ate like a banana, an RX bar. Um, what else did I eat? Had a protein shake after the workout. Much needed. Uh, I don't know. I think that was about it. And then we, we did a really brutal workout today, a hero workout. Uh, so basically, the long, long story of it, I ended up running a mile with a 35-pound a plate for the first half and then a 25-pound weight plate for the second half, um, which was brutal in itself. And then we had to do a bunch of exercises in, in there, including rope climbs and uh, he decently heavy front squats. And then some toes to bar uh, type stuff where you have to touch your toes to the bar. Very gymnastic workout. So my my shoulders, pecs, neck are just destroyed right now. I even scaled it down a lot, and it was still like a thirty, a little over thirty minutes straight workout. So imagine doing something kind of grueling for thirty minutes. So needless to say, I am going to earn this breakfast for sure. Right, let me catch up here with you guys. Oh, there's a lot of links, you guys. Click at your own risk. Uh, so you linked all four of them. I don't know. Uh, I think I have five episodes too. Or I mean, are the what are the YouTube links that you have? Are those the, like my episodes? Is that what you're referring to? Or are they just something else? Oh, Thomas the Tank Engine. <laughs> I love it. Be happy with the fourth link? I don't know. We'll see. This this isn't very loud. My laptop. I mean, I'll let I'll let you guys. I mean, I usually don't need music on the cooking stream as much. It would kind of make sense though to do that. Um, I don't know. I guess I could try to do music next time. I know Slissa does. I do have like a sound system in my living room that would probably carry. I have to kind of figure it out. Get on Pandora or something like that again. I could do it on my phone too. But I'm kind of reluctant to do that because I have to keep touching the phone. And that makes bo boopy sounds for you guys. Thomas is in there. Rip, rip Thomas the tank engine. Um, so we have pancakes. I saw bacon, bacon, bacon. Any other favorite breakfast of you guys? Hearing the sizzle makes me hungry. It worked. Hey, thank you so much. Who cares for popping in? Uh, good luck, buddy, with the project. Don't hurt yourself or anybody around you. Chicken cooking. What are you uh, making with the chicken? We made adult chicken nuggets, as I like to call it, uh, last week. They were, they were really good. I still have some left. They were actually better every day as a leftover than they were fresh because I used coconut flour, which is really dry, and it just sucks the moisture out of your throat. Like, there's a couple... Uh, instances of where I'm just like, <coughs> I can't breathe here. Um, but for whatever reason, it just got better throughout the week. 
Mr. Gray, what do you say? Hey, 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 it's Mr. Gray. How you doing, buddy? Breakfast burritos, you got it. I'm making up some sausage. I'm using the, uh, you can kind of see it, it probably looks a little gross, but all natural swaggerties, all natural preservative free sausage. You know, I, I want the extra mile, try to get, you know, supposedly uh, cleaner ingredients. I got some, got my usual hash browns. Um, these are white potatoes, which are supposedly a little, not so paleo and, you know, but not too bad. It's just got potatoes and dextrose in it. So pretty, pretty lean. And then we have, uh, you know, I did the Udi's pizza a couple weeks ago. We're going to use the trailer uh, gluten-free tortillas. That's all the fresh time had for gluten-free stuff. They are frozen too, by the way. So that's going to be a, something of a challenge maybe. But I think that's how they recommend is to uh, probably cook it. I'm going to cook it in a skillet um, frozen until it warms up completely. See what happens. About to head into work. That's awesome. And by awesome, I mean, sorry you guys going to work, but it's awesome that you're here. I'm still, I'm still very intrigued. Mr. Gray is also a streamer. Uh, streams various of the building games, uh, or at least uh, one of them I've seen. I think uh, I always forget the name of it, but every time I see it, it's just so magnificent. Like seeing the city that he's built. How, how is the new uh, graphics card treating you? Are you able to build in like the fourth and fifth dimension now? I bet you can. So we're just uh, breaking up the sausage. We're cooking it through. We're going to use the sausage grease. And then we're going to cook the uh, city skylines. Thank you so much. Hey, Jay Hills. How you doing? Yeah, very early stream today. Um, I'm gonna, I told some friends I'd go over and play poker with them later. And uh, cheap, cheap. <laughs> go ahead and play poker with them later. Uh, and help them build some shelves, which I'm not handy, so I'm really just going to watch them build shelves. Um, so that's why I believe the early streamer stream today. Plus, I want to try to get some more European hours for my my Euro friends. I I feel awful that you know I can't do early streams during the week because I got the old day job and such, and I just would not like to start my day with streaming, and then go to work, and then streaming again. I know Regis Kilburn can do, do that. He's a machine. Um, you know, maybe if I worked from home and, you know, I didn't do the working out stuff as much, but that's kind of a big passion of mine is doing CrossFit in the morning, getting it out of the way. Um, so the sausage is almost done. After this, we're going to throw the sausage. Um, I haven't decided. I think we're going to throw the hash browns in next. No, nah, I think we'll do the peppers. We'll do the peppers next, which means we should probably get the eggs ready too. Let me catch up here with chat. Glad to hear your, uh, your computer is one tenth less potato. That's good. That's a good uh, direction to go to. Chicken with a side of hash browns dirt board. That's awesome. I should try that. See you, Dirt Board. Thanks for hanging out, buddy. Yeah, see you, Mr. Gray. Good luck with work. No worries, buddy. Thanks for popping in, as always. Um, so I think we'll we'll do the peppers next. So we got the old usual bird's eye peppers. Um, we'll cook those from Frozen. Not the movie. By the way, this is going to be kind of a little awkward because this isn't a ton of grease compared to what I when I do the bacon. Like I have like bowls and pans worth of grease that I can kind of keep reapplying grease for hash brown for the stir fry. I like to use the same grease uh, for that just to you know save on the oil that you put in and you get that natural flavor. Anyways, Jay Hill's motto is: If the woman don't. I think you're handsome. At least they find you handy. Yes, that's a nice red green reference. I love it. I I grew up on that show. <laughs> hey, you know I'll take it. You know I I think I mentioned that in my first episode too. I mean I I can, I mean I'm not handy, you know with like cleaning or building stuff that much. But I can, I can cook. I'm all right. I can cook without embarrassing myself. I actually enjoy it. I mean that's one of my favorite 
things to do on a date, you know, usually first, second, third date, whatever, uh, just cook, because I'm more of a homebody. So I prefer to do that instead of going out to the bars or, you know, sometimes sporting events are nice, but I really enjoy the, the uh, being in my wonderfully comfortable home, because I, I uh, made it my own. I have my man cave for, for start, college football Saturdays and other big sporting events. Got my computer room all set up to stream and hang out with you guys. It's pretty good. It's pretty good, guys. All right, this is... So for a few pieces, this is pretty well cooked. Um, oh, man, I am sore. I am going to be absolutely wrecked later today. I also didn't sleep in. I woke up at 5 this morning, unfortunately. Would have liked to wake up, you know, around 6.30 or 7, but laid in bed for an hour and worked on some stream stuff. For those of you who don't know, we did hit our uh, 25 sub goal, so I'm super excited about that. We had a huge surge of subs, six subs last night, and every 25, um, like, concurrent subs that we have, so 50 would be the next milestone. I'm going to do a drawing for, for all those concern, concurrent subs for a uh, $20 gift card to Blizzard or possibly Amazon. Blizzard's a little bit easier, I think, because then I can just email you a, a code. I don't know. I haven't done Amazon yet. Okay. So let's see here. All right, so we got the sausage. No, oh, no, there's still some pink pieces here. Two pounds of sausage. You know, it's gonna, gonna take a while. We're also gonna do about probably 20 eggs. I mean, we're not gonna be able to fit all this in the burritos, and I'm certainly not gonna eat all this today. Like I. Like I ate the entire pizza last night. That was probably irresponsible, but it was delicious. Um, but we're going to cook a bunch of eggs, scramble them up for the burritos. It'll be good. Um, I'm going to have to cook two sets of hash browns with it as well. I might cook one set while, while we eat because I'm really hungry. Um, I could probably start getting this warmed up as well. I am. All these are frozen together. Yeah. Could be a problem. Here we go. Crisis averted. All right. So we'll warm this pan up. I'll, I'll uh, heat up the tortillas there. transfer this, make room for our peppers. Oh yeah, look at all that freedom right there. Oh, so good. Mmm. God bless America. All right. I know I didn't have my bandana today. I actually had to wash it. It's uh, been too long. A couple weeks since I washed it. Had to be responsible, guys. Okay, let's do this. We don't need to throw any more oil in there because we got uh, got the sausage grease. Ooh, it's starting to smell like fire, guys. I'm gonna turn on the fan and maybe open up the house a little bit. Uh, maybe we'll, maybe we'll turn off. We'll turn off the fan here in a little bit because it's probably loud and obnoxious. If it's loud and obnoxious, I'll turn it off now. Just let me know. Got a little bit of tea left here. Uh, I need to crack a bunch of eggs also, but I wanted to show you uh, my favorite tea. I've showed you it before, but Yogi Sweet Tangerine Positive Energy, my favorite tea. Had one of those earlier, and I'm trying to... Okay. Ah, oh, oh. Bloopers, bloopers, bloopers. Okay, we're good, saved. Uh, let's see, what else we have? Then this is a new one I'm trying. I tried, I'm currently kind of drinking it now. Uh, green tea, blackberry, moringa. It sounds fancy, so that's why I chose it. It's okay. It's okay. But Yogi Tea is my favorite brand. Try to get a sponsorship. We'll see. Probably won't happen, but that's all right. Okay. We got some shredded cheese, which I don't normally eat a lot of cheese, but I don't... I've, would feel just like a horrible person if I did not eat it with that cheese. 
Uh, we'll show this in here. I think actually technically I'm supposed to flip this every 10 seconds. That's, that's something that I'm definitely not going to do. Uh, but maybe every minute, if I remember. Guys, remind me. We need a command and a flip, flip it. Uh, we're also going to use this Chipotle seasoning on the hash browns. This is phenomenal seasoning. Uh, a Rent-A-Chef seasoning. Uh, I get this at my local grocery store. Hopefully you can find it on Amazon. It's really good. It's It's got some pow to it. But not like super, super spicy. But it's it brings the freedom, I'll tell you that. I'm going to go grab my eggs. I'm actually going to have to crack some eggs. Maybe I'll crack them over here. So you can, you can still chill with you guys. Accidentally grabbed in, uh, a cider beer as well. Complete accident. It is afternoon technically. Just say so you're scoring at home. Just feels like a nice thing to enjoy with you guys here. All right, let's flip, 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 Flipadelphia. All right. Get this. Get this out of the way. Okay, I really need to work on those eggs. I have 20 to crack, so it's gonna take a while. All right. So I like to get the Trader Joe's brown eggs sometimes. My my grandma actually has some chickens too, so sometimes I get them from there. But uh, it's it was just easier just to buy the eggs. So we got a lot to go through here, guys. Time to get messy. This is probably, yeah, this is gonna cook a little bit better than I thought. So I'm gonna turn this down really low. All right. Let's see if I can one hand it. Oh, oh, one handed, one handed. Hey, one deadly kitten, how are you doing, dear? I'm, I'm gonna have enough. So, I mean, I have, if you can eat, Four or less breakfast burritos. There's enough for you if you just want to fly here from a uh, uh, Rock City, Detroit Rock City, ish. Sorry, I revealed your location. Now everybody knows where you're at. All right, we are four eggs in, sixteen more to go. Peppers are getting free to me here. How's your day going, ODK? Shells everywhere. Hey, Evan, with the are you kidding me? Are you kidding me right now? <laughs> oh, let's see if we can do one handed again. Uh, uh, not efficient, not efficient, but awesome. We really need efficiency right now. The person and the concept. All right, I wish you'd just stay open there. There we go. All right. Almost through the first batch. Glad your day is okay. Anything exciting on the agenda today? Are you gonna to stream today? One Deadly Kitten. Race against time here. All right, let's get through this batch and we're gonna take the peppers out so they don't catch on fire. All right, so down with one, making only a slight mess. All right, let's. Oh yeah, look at that. Look at that freedom going on there. That's a pretty good looking shell, actually. Let's get a little bit of roundness on the other side. So for those of you that just joined, we're, we're trying gluten-free Udi's, U-D-I, uh, 
gluten-free uh, tortillas. See how, we, how those go. That's what we need here. Let's take this out of the pool. That's a full, full thing of freedom right there. So we got the peppers done, we got the sausage done. Now are the the hash browns take a while. I'm trying to debate on how I want, what order I want to cook all this stuff in. I think we'll still do eggs last, especially since I'm not done cracking all the eggs. So we're just gonna have to grease, grease the pan a couple times because these hash browns just soak it up. We'll try, uh, we'll do the coconut oil spray like we did last time. Get a lot in there. I don't know, we'll see how it goes with coconut spray. <laughs> yes, thank you for calling out the snowblower. It's it's kind of my thing here. Um, as you know, snow happens. And it's nice to have that. Although, fortunately, I haven't needed it for, I haven't needed it for a little over a month, but it's still uh, kind of borderline wanting to snow here. It did snow actually last week. Oh, man. Get in there. I still wish they could design these bags a little bit better. Hopefully by the next cooking episode, I will have my grill out. And actually, I'll have my road bike over there. Not my grill, but I'll have my grill out of my shed. Put that in place of my grill. Grill out in the cooking utensil, not a human being grill. And uh, yeah, have my bike out and not have to worry about it. Yeah, it, it kind of snow rains recently. I don't know, maybe it was like, maybe not this most recent week, but pretty pretty recently. I, it wasn't where I needed that, but it still is like, seriously, it's late March, let's, let's be done with this. All right, so let's throw the chipotle seasoning in here. Look at this, I mean, maybe you can see the inside of this without me dumping it all, all over the place. So much freedom in there, oh yeah. It kind of smells like a, I mean, I'm sure it's true Chipotle, Chipotle or Chipotle, however, you would, however it's correct to say. Um, but it kind of has like a smoky bacon smell to it. So right there, you obviously should buy six, six of them. Don't know if it's available on Amazon. I buy it at the local grocery store, uh, but find it. So it's um, a rent as chef, uh, Chipotle season. Quasar, how you doing, buddy? It's been a while. Hope you're doing well. All right, time to crack some more eggs, guys. Let's do it. Well, that's funny you mentioned that, Evan, because my I did break my blender. Uh, so I might, we might try that. It'd be pretty disgusting, though. Definitely not as clean as my blender was. But my blender, I kind of showed it to you, but it's one of those, you, you do this, you snap it in, and I was making some smoothies with it. And I think when the smoothies got so cold, it like basically, like it was so locked in, and like I, I was getting so frustrated and so hungry. I'm like, like, I just tore the handle right off and just obliterated it. Um, so I need to figure out what I'm gonna do about that. So I need to buy like a new, um, I don't know, what, the plastic thing that you can snap in there. It was, it was very frustrating. <laughs> uh, it slices, it dices, it stirs and fries and launches vegetables 20 feet across the kitchen. Bye now. Hey, Zion's, how you doing, man? Top of the morning to you, or top of the afternoon. Whichever you're celebrating right now. Oh, so many eggs, guys. We're, we got a couple more to go here. Maybe just two more. Yeah, two more to go. We did it. One more. One more egg to be defeated on our quest for scrambled eggs. Oh, still need to beat the crap out of them. Got to rough them up. One deadly kitten's always ready to fight, so maybe we need to let her do this. 
<clears throat> all right so we're in good shape here now all right this is since this is on low this is a pretty good looking burrito though i like this side of it i like to get it that that brown on the other side oh, double foot there we go it's starting to get there what because you're always like fight me bro i know that's just a, a funny thing you're saying but I'm, I'm gonna hold that above your head for a while because it's pretty hilarious all right oops that I know I'm gonna make more of a mess. Just got a little bit of egg that came out. It's fine. It's fine, guys. Don't panic. All right, let me move this so I can actually see it. Which is better? Evan asked, which is better to say, good morning to if it's too early, your time or the streamer's time? Yeah, I guess it's probably pretty late for you, right? I think you're in uh, the land of Europe, right? All right, we're uh, smashing this down. Try to get all the moisture out of here. We're only on medium. We could probably kick it up a notch. Bam! All right, let's see. We haven't even opened the apple cider yet, too. So I accidentally grabbed an apple cider when I went into the, the fridge. So we're, you know, why not? It's afternoon here. It is 12.32 p.m. Cheers, friends. Yeah, good night feels like a bye for sure. You know, good evening or uh, see. I know a little bit of German. Guten Abend is good. Good afternoon. Guten Nacht. I don't know if you're German. I'm just trying to show off here. But uh, Guten Morgen is morning. Ooh, we got ourselves a brown crisp here, guys. I reckon. All right, let's flip, flip these bad boys. I don't think they're gonna get as brown as I'd like because we don't have like a bountiful amount of bacon grease like we usually do when we when we cook this. But it's gonna be cooked and it's gonna be edible and it's gonna go in my belly. And that's all I care about. I think I'm gonna have so much and I'm gonna, I only have six tortillas. So I'm probably gonna like leverage this into breakfast pizza as well. I don't know if I'll I'll do that episode because I know tomorrow Slissa will be um, doing her cooking stream. And she did breakfast pizza last week, which was kind of inspired me to do breakfast burritos. Uh, just because I used to make it all the time. Outside of Philly. I was so close. Europe, East Philly, I mean. I'm, I'm working on it, guys. I, I apologize. I need to work on it. I'm trying to remember where everybody's at. Although, of course, you know, if you never feel like talking about your location, just say parts unknown or make something completely up. It's all good. All right, we're gonna we're gonna use the fork to beat all 20 of our eggs. Beat them real good. Beat them like they stole something. We'll salt and pepper them to. While this cooks, we're in really good shape. This is a lot quicker than my uh, bacon episodes because when I usually do bacon, I cook four packs of bacon. And that can take a while. I uh, usually th oven them, bake them in the oven, as well as cook some in here so that I can have the grease for the other things to happen as well. Ugh, come on, let's get all these eggs. Yeah, you could help uh, her with the computer. Did you get it? Did you guys get it figured out, or was it still going off yesterday? Yeah, I know it is lots of peeps to remember. I know, but I, it's still, I mean, I feel like it's the least I can do. I love, I love knowing just you know a little bit about everybody. It's gonna be. That's obviously a very difficult, uh, daunting task, even with like my viewership now, which I'm very happy with. But you know, if we continue to grow, it's gonna get even more difficult. But you know, that's a good problem to have. I don't know, that's just always kind of been my thing. I want to at least know a little bit about somebody, you know, that means something to them. And usually, you know, where you're from is pretty important. I'm going to throw a little bit more chipotle on here. Just a tiny bit. It is really, 
it's intense. It's like a really intense like girlfriend. It's it's like all right, I don't know what I'm getting into. We'll see. Uh, you gotta you gotta walk cautiously with it. Pepper that bad boy up. Uh, maybe a little more. Fight the eggs, brah. <laughs> Come at me, brah. Hey eggs, you even lift, brah? Right. Boom, off, off the overhead. That's pretty good. I think it's just drying out at this point. It's not getting, I need to probably turn it up a little bit. All right, let's pop that bad boy in there. All right. Okay, let's stir the salt and pepper up in this bad boy. <laughs> yeah, you really go ham, haha. <laughs> I love it. I wish we had ham right now as well. I know that stands for something that I cannot say on the stream, and I love it. Thank you. All right. Uh, let's see. I am going to be right back. I drank way too much tea, so I got to go a uh, quick bathroom break while this cooks. So we're in a safe spot here. Guys, watch the food. Watch the food. <laughs> All right, I'm back. Did anything catch on fire? How was it? So much responsibility to sign up for. You just wanted to come here and hang out. And I'm like, dude, seriously, I gotta watch the food? I'm sorry, Quasar. I was a lot to put on you guys, but nothing's on fire, so we'll we'll call it a we'll call it a good job here. All right. How is the fan sound? Is it ridiculous? Does it sound ridiculous? So, Evan says of Athena's computer, it was still having issues. She ran a cleaner, malware bytes, uh, not much left, but dust off, driver update, defrag. Okay. Uh, so, you think that she might think it needs to re reformat, uh, but I don't know what she does to her comp. Uh, then it might need a total refresh. Yeah, I mean, that's always the, hit the restart button. Hey, Alphers, uh, let's see. Why am I not using cast iron? I need to, I need to uh, temper my cast iron, but you're right, it's probably a better, better solution. I, by no means am I a pro cook by any means. I'm just a dude that makes food. Uh, I have been cooking for a long time, though. Oh, that's a good-looking crisp. Oh, my goodness. Guys, Craigasm. I'll show it to you. Oh, my goodness. Okay, we did we did all right here. Ooh, that's almost too crispy. Psych? No such thing. Uh, let's see. Boop, boop. All right, this might be good here. This is, oh, my goodness. This is with coconut oil, too. I'm pretty happy with this. Let's, let's not burn ourselves, but I don't know if we can kind of see that. Look at that brown crust. Oh, um, I haven't really cooked with cast iron. I know I need to work on it. I've just been too lazy to, to season my skillet. Um, but you're right. I, that's probably a good reminder to, to work on that. Oh, it probably would be better. I never really thought about that. Oh, yeah. Mmm. God bless America, guys. Cheers. Cheers. Hey, jerks. I know it is a nice cabin. Thank you very much. It's either cabin or snowblower. Whichever you prefer. Snowblower is funnier. 
All right, whoops. <coughs> All right, it's getting a little too smoky in here. All right, let's put this in this container. Maybe we'll just go ahead. We'll uh, we'll go ahead and do the other hash browns too, because those move fairly, you know, a little quicker than I thought they would. Usually, like I said, I have a lot more grease. So I feel like they, they cook, well, they probably don't cook quicker. They actually probably cook slower because the grease kind of sogs them down. Ooh. Yeah, there's some, I'm gonna actually put that on for a few too many minutes. That, or either that or the, it's kind of hard to tell. Like the chipotle is kind of, like I said, a little spicy, a little zingy. So it kind of tastes like fire. All right, let's go. Oh, whoop. Put a bit more coconut oil on here. Do our second batch. All right, let's ugh, get open there. So we're, we're doing pretty good. All we need to do is our eggs after this, and then it's time to feast. So probably another 15 to 20 minutes we'll be ready to eat. I just don't like this container. Like it's, the bag is kind of stupid. Cause there's always like hash browns that get stuck on the sides because there's, uh, I don't know, just the way it's built. So we're just gonna do this. Turn our socks inside out, throw that away. All right, get that out of our life. We don't need that trash in our life. How you doing today, Jerks? How's the new computer, bud? Okay, ba, 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 a little more, more chipotle, maybe a little less than I did the last time. Cause like I said, very intense. All right, let's flip this. Boom, oh, look at that. That might be, that's almost too much, but that's, we can work with that. It's uh, the merits of paying attention to your uh, stuff. All right, let's see what we got here, guys. Just type fire and caps. <laughs> yeah. I love it. Baked an entire, entire sheet of diced potatoes. Oh, potatoes just sound so good right now. I'm so ready for these. I am not from Missouri, I'm from Iowa. Ooh, container of sweet potatoes. Oh, bring on the delicious, delicious carbs. So good. So good. Scrambled eggs, gotta have that. Oh, I didn't see the name. Yeah, uh, no, you guys are not jerks. Just jerks had doing is the jerks in a grid way. Hey, Yum Pickles, this is my breakfast. Well, I mean, it's whatever, it's just food, really, is what it is. Um,. No, Jerks is a very, very good friend of mine. Been one of my first supporters of the stream. Not a jerk. Call clip rights. All right, Evan's on it if something catches on fire. Uh, we might have been, I don't think we were too close to a fire, but we'll see. That's pretty good. I think we're gonna roll with that. Uh, so this side I get, I like this, I love the brown, not to, you know, the past that burnt stage. You go to the table. There's like a lot of little, like little flower action going on with this. So again, those are the gluten-free uh, tortillas made by Udi's. All right, we're in pretty good shape here. Yeah, sweet potatoes are so good. I actually have some right here. So when you, when you come over with one deadly kitten, you can have a sweet potato if you want for dessert for a brunch dessert. Is that a thing? I love sweet potato fries, young pickles. They're so good. I actually make those quite a bit during the summer. I'll just buy potatoes, dice them up. I throw them on the grill because it really soaks up the water and sears them really well to where they can do pretty well. They're not as good as like if you were to get at a restaurant, but the stuff you get at restaurants is so full of, you know, other things that kind of help them uh, have a good crisp, I think. So they're not just like straight sweet potatoes. Um, so it's pretty good and still healthy-ish. 
Regular potatoes had rosemary, garlic, pepper, and onion. Rosemary and white potatoes go really well together. All right, let's squeeze out these hash of browns. You're gonna try to get that moisture out. How long did it take you to flip it like that? So I'm glad you asked. Um, I actually, back in high school, as a, uh, I was gonna put some in, in my mouth, I was gonna put some hash browns in my mouth, but I'm gonna tell the story first. So uh, back in high school, me and my buddy would make, um, would make hash browns quite, quite often, or not hash browns, sorry, uh, make tacos, and I was, always, I was always the guy in the frying pan. And his, you know, his, his house, his mom's house, back in high school, and I was just, I just like, well, we'll, we'll try to do this, and I don't know, got pretty good at it. I got some good wrist strength, and this is a little bit harder with this pan because there's the, I don't know, I, it's just not like a sloped super. I mean, it's sloped a little bit enough, but sometimes if it's, you know, if it's sloped a little bit more, it's a little bit easier to flip. Home invite already? I mean, you said you're hungry. I, I invited you earlier for the hash browns. I don't know how, uh, how long the drive is from uh, Detroit Rock City, though. Pretty long, probably. I mean, you're a sub, so. And, if, and I've already screened you. You're, you're a streamer. All right. Although you might fight me, though, so I guess maybe I should kind of hold off on that. Hey, fresh new socks! Thank you so much for the host. I saw you popping in uh, with Leo Fox Nation. That's awesome of you, man. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. I don't remember seeing you in Athena's chat, I think, a few times. Yeah, I've, I've definitely cooked shirtless before. Not on Twitch. Um, and that will never happen. Um, but, yeah, definitely, especially cooking bacon, just like, yeah, it just, it wrecks you. It's... It's kind of like, probably like Chinese uh, waterboarding or Chinese water torture, I guess. Probably just like that. Maybe worse. What do you mean by, is that call waiting? Is there something like on my phone that's popping up? <laughs> or uh, somebody call me? We should be getting a flip here. Oh yeah. All right. I got some uh, paste salsa as well. Thought about buying. Thought about buying some guac. I used to make pretty decent guac too, but I'm just too lazy for that. And avocados are expensive. I know guacamole is more expensive, but. You know, if you're gonna pay a lot for that stuff, might as well just be done. All right, time to time to preview. Mm. My mistress is texting me. That's probably not good. I was just making sure there wasn't any text on there, or is it just vibrating? Yeah, thank you, the Alan F song, I love it. <laughs> Burritos and $20, congratulations again, Alec, for winning the, uh, um, the subscriber giveaway. I can't see like what are you guys hearing a vibration sound or you, or what how is that working out? I'm trying to figure this out. I can't scroll up and chat fast enough. <laughs> I, th I thought about doing music too. I think I'll do that maybe next time. I'll get that set up because we're almost done. Well, you know, I might be able to do that. I could do it on my phone, but then I have to keep touching the phone to move you around and start beeping and booping. 
Okay, vibration stopped. Okay, good. Sorry about that. Okay, so we got maybe a few more minutes on this bad boy. Several more minutes on this. A call waiting sound. Oh, whoops, I accidentally grabbed this trophy. Where did this come from, guys? So this, uh, so as you, many know, we do, I do CrossFit, which is a exercise methodology. I was the captain of a team this year, which we do a little, just a little fun thing at our gym where, yeah, how random, right? I, it just fell in my hands. And uh, so I just wanted to share this with you guys. So it's pretty awesome. So I was the captain of the team and basically it was just a fun, bunch of fun little activities that we do, like dress up, uh, like some of my Discord. Uh, probably if you scroll up, for those of you that are newer, um, you'll see like we dressed in all American flag gear and it was awesome. Wonder whose idea that was. And uh, just do lots of little other things. And so it was, just, it was really gratifying because it was kind of my first time uh, well, I was kind of the captain last year, kind of not. Uh, but led a team this year, and it was just awesome. We merrily won last week, so I wanted to share that with you guys because you guys are my home grills, my home, my home boys, and my home grills. Okay, good. Hopefully no more sounds, I apologize for that. The, uh, learn it, trying to get a tiny smidge better every time I stream from my phone. There's usually something that goes wrong, like I, I touch the screen and then it just like flips around and I mean, I don't know, I know the Streamlabs is still in beta. Uh, I need to give them some feedback on it. It's still pretty sweet. You can do it from Twitch too, but I, when I, I did my first episode from Twitch, and it seemed like I couldn't see chat very well. I don't know, I could be wrong. I must have been able to see it okay because I was reading chat. All right, that's off. This could be cooked more. Yeah, we'll cook it some more. We won't be, we won't cut corners. Oh, sticky. Who knew? Who knew potatoes were sticky, guys? Mm. Yeah, I know. <laughs> There's lots of weird sounds that throw people off, so you're not the first one. You probably won't be the last one, one deadly kitten. What does everybody got going on today? What's everybody doing on a on a wonderful Saturday? I got this from Trader Joe's yesterday. Henry Hot Spurs Hard Press for Cider. I got one of those, made a sampler pack. Um, so thought I'd try that cider. Eh, it's okay. It's all right. Nothing to get excited about. Do you know it's brown and sticky? A stick. That's a fact. That's actually just a fact. And that's good. I like facts. Fun, fun, but real facts. Talking about the real, real facts and the issues going on here. Thank you, Quasar. Ooh, game night at Young Pickle's house. What are we playing? Uh, maybe some uh, Monopoly? Keep trying to get Athena to play Monopoly on stream. I, I, might be, I might be getting her closer to it. We'll see. Now with the way the Hearthstone ladder is, where you don't go down as much, like I feel like most streamers are a little bit bored of just going up and down the Legend ladder. So I think it's actually going to maybe be a negative for Hearthstone because people will start streaming other games. Uh, Maybe they'll play, you know, like they'll play Overwatch and Heroes of the Storm. Like I might try to play a little Heroes of the Storm just to try that a little bit. But I really need to play Fortnite, catch up on my quests. Um, thought about doing that. If we have time, I might do some Fortnite after this instead of Hearthstone. Just because we, we did some Hearthstone so long yesterday. And if I were to do Hearthstone, I'd complete the two more quests for Paladin. And I feel like everybody was a little sick of Murak Paladin by the end of the night. I love board games. I know Jerk's just thinking about um, setting up like a tabletop night or something like that. So if we do that, either him or I will stream that. All right, this is just not browning anymore. Let's let's be done with this. All right, let's see if we can get the rest of this in her. Woo! 
Told you, that sneaks up on you like a crazy ex-girlfriend. You gotta watch your back, guys. That's your pulte. Are you good? I don't know. I, I should definitely still put a little bit less in there. Well, maybe the salsa will kind of take the edge off of it a little bit. Just need to make some eggs, scramble some eggs. Put that over there, right there. Get our coconut spray. Yeah, why are the potatoes so sticky? Yeah, there's still water in them. And I mean, potatoes have, I think it's probably the starch in them that make with combined with like water or maybe heat it up it's kind of sticky you know kind of i was just thinking about that too i don't know if you guys played fallout i think it was fallout 4 where the most recent one was um like that's one of the things i think is you can make glue and i think it was with uh potatoes potatoes is one of the ingredients if i remember correctly so you need like so many potatoes and in the such all right, so we need to keep an eye on this for sure. This is gonna cook fast, I reckon. <laughs> I learned that I wasn't a creative segue to your trophy. It was a, was that, a, a seg? I don't remember, I've seen that word before, but I don't remember what that, what that is or means. We are almost ready to eat, guys. I'm so excited. I've been looking forward to this all. Well, this, the pizza, I've been looking forward to all week, and then I accidentally ate the whole thing. So let that be known. Don't, you know, hold, hold stuff out for a whole week because you'll just go crazy. In my defense, that pizza was a little thinner than the pizza that I was planning on getting. And it was delicious. And since I put the scoreboard of how many slices I put on there, that probably uh, made my competitive side feel like I should probably eat the whole thing. So needless to say, waking up this morning, I had kind of still a pretty full tummy, but then doing the workout today, I definitely used up a lot of those carbs and all those good, wonderful calories that it provided me. Ooh, Jerks has house guests. I appreciate you being here instead of uh, hanging out with them. Did we, uh, Jerks, did we decide? I think I was the only one that responded about the tabletop game as me and Fulton. But I mean, I would, I would check it out. I almost thought about buying that table, Topia or whatever it's called, from Steam. But the problem was, I was like, I don't understand. I don't, I've never heard of any of these games and I mean, it'd be fun to do with you guys, like you and Fulton, Rachel, whoever else you guys, you get together to do it. I mean, I, I can learn. I'm old, but I can still learn. I can learn a few new tricks. Oh, seg is when you, uh, is it pronounced seg? Because I know I've heard segway. Or is that actually how you spell segway? And people have been spelling it wrong with W-A-Y. They're on their way out. Good. Get them out of there. Get them out of there. No, thanks for the tips, One Deadly Kitten. I appreciate that. By no means am I a pro cook, pro cook, pro chef, or whatever. Uh, I've just been cooking for a long time, and I'm not that picky on how things are. But definitely don't doubt that there's some techniques that can do better. The, the only reason why I didn't crank these up more is there's still there's not a lot of oil in here. And I think you really need the oil to get a, a good brown crisp for the most part. Uh, and so really, you know, that this just soaks up that oil and then, you know, kind of feel like it doesn't, uh, you know, especially the second side of it because I didn't really grease the top of it. I should have should have probably sprayed the top of it too. Hindsight won't matter. It's just helpful to not be a picky eater because I'm going to eat it regardless. 
This is actually, I should turn this up a little bit. Segway is a two wheel thingy, okay. I, okay, I have seen that spell with G U E then, okay. Thank you, guys. I learned something today. We have, we f figured out what's brown and sticky, a stick, and we figured out the correct spelling for Segway. Guys, education stream. The more you know. All right, this is taking a little longer than I'd like. You're not a pro, just a mom. Mom ha moms have super abilities at cooking better than bachelors for sure. Catching up on chat here. Okay, so you do like a, I don't know if a brine is really the right term, jerks, but um, that's pretty interesting. I like that. So jerk says he, if you get crispy hash browns, slice them up, soak them in salty water, dry them out thoroughly, and then fry them. Yeah, and I'm using frozen ones too, so there's, there's definitely still some liquids in there that I could be uh, taking out. Like I said, not picky eater. I prefer efficiency and eating quicker versus quality of food. Some of you may uh, shake your head at me and I understand, it's fair. It's fair. All right. They're sticking a little bit. But they're finally getting cooked. I turned it down too well. Oh my god, I can't wait to eat, guys. Oh. This needs to get in my belly now. Not now, but right now. Yeah, I'm, I'm definitely up for that, jerks. So let me know. I know I, I'm the weird one that goes to bed super early. It, it haunts me in my, in my real life, too. So, you know, just let me know when uh, when you guys can do it. You know, ideally, like on a Saturday or Sunday, it would be awesome, too. But I know you guys have relationships and significant others. And some of you guys have kids. And you got you to gotta tend to them, so I understand. Or you just like to stay up late. But I have none of those things, and yet I still choose to go to bed super early. It serves me well. Probably won't change, but that's all right. I'll just have to miss out on some of the fun things sometimes. Speaking of which, how late did you stream last night, One Deadly Kitten? I know you had the bottle of wine out. We were having some fun conversations with the, with the group. Turned into an IRL stream. It was good. Pretty good. Future... Future partner streamer right there, guys. Make sure you shoot One Deadly Kitten a follow. As well as Jerks, a, uh, uh, I don't know what I should call you as far as, I don't know your level of Fortnite. I think we used to be decent at the game, but I feel like I haven't played with you in a while. Certainly, I feel like I've gotten worse as others have gotten better. I know you're pretty modest about your skills, but you've definitely been... You are never have been, uh, never AFK have been one of the better ones of our group. All right, eggs are pretty close to done. We'll see if we can get them brown. <laughs> Tinder alert. More alerts come through, guys. I'm not on Tinder anymore. That was. I got on there like, Ugh, this is a bad idea. Not, not on there anymore. Or not on any of the dating apps. I, I'm still on Match, but I need to cancel that. I really don't use it very much. I'm pretty happy with the single life. Occasionally I'll get on there. and uh, like I had a date last Friday, but I just wasn't interested. So uh, You guys are all my date, so it's fine. I got, I got tons of you guys as friends. I enjoy my own time. I really don't have a ton of time to date right now anyways. 
with streaming, working out, working, cooking, uh, doing all that. So, uh, let's see, do we want to put some cheese on now? No, let's, let's not do that. We could put the cheese on now, just start getting the melt going. Uh, let's, I like to throw everything in the pool here. It's gonna be a, it's gonna be very difficult to do that though. This pan is not big enough for the both of us guys. Yeah, maybe we'll just separate. We'll put everything on separate. Feels, feels wrong. I like to always have my stuff combined, but that's okay. All right. Just go ahead and we'll do it in here so you guys can see it. And I'll move you guys to the table. Yeah, I use the chopped up kind of hash browns in the bag too, which is what I had, the Trader Joe's version. I really like that. Just so much easier. What do you call a boomerang that doesn't come back? A stick. <laughs> That's awesome. All right, let me make sure I catch them in chat before I eat. Hey, see you, Quasar. Thank you so much for hanging out, bud. Hopefully I didn't miss you. Too kind, too kind. My, my face though, what did I do with my face? Was my face cut off? Was my, what's wrong with my face guys? Now I'm self-conscious about my face. Not really, not really. You'll have to ask jerks in the board game. So he's got a like table, do you have the tabletop topia or whatever it's called? There's lots of very obscure games. I think one was called Secret Hitler. Uh, I don't know if we should play that one. There's a couple of funny name ones too. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think, I thought you were, you were a little quieter even before you, well, I guess you did have music on. The music I don't think was too bad. It's always, it's hard to tweak all that stuff. Like mine seems to change a little bit every time. Um, or at least nobody, not everybody like tells me it's wrong. I mean, it's, it's different too, because I think you hear it different on mobile. Um, <laughs> Obscure, modern. <laughs> yeah, there you go. That's a better way to say it. Um, let's put the cheese on the bottom here. Let's just start making this. I'm, I'm gonna try to catch up with, keep up with Chad as much as I can. I'll have to bring the laptop over. I'm getting uh, some shredded Colby Jack. I thought Colby Jack would be good. I like having a little blended cheese. Bueno. Oh man, I haven't wrapped a tortilla in forever. And to a burrito, there's a there's a good technique that I probably forgot how to do. All right, let's just put a little bit more in there. I think, if I recall, like I haven't made breakfast burritos in years, several years. Used to be, I make them all the time. Woo, it's, it's hot. Imagine that. That's also hot. Boop. I've only burned myself three times today, guys. Pretty good. All right, let's put the peppers and the sausage in there. Oh, this feels so wrong to me, guys. Putting things on separately. It's probably more well received. I don't know. A better methodology, but you know, it's not my thing. Yeah, this is way too much. In the... This is going to be a taco, guys. New plan. Tacos, breakfast tacos. So I think the, met the method was you, you do the tops first. You can't see this at all. You're just gonna have to use your imagination. Do the tops and then fold each side, but I put way too much in here. So this is a taco now. Boom, look at that. Taco life, guys, look at that. Who wants a bite? First one here gets a bite. I can't remember who that was. Oh. Mmm. All right, let's bring this to the table. All right, everything's off. No fires, no fires today, guys. I'll bring you over to the uh, kitchen table here shortly. I just want to get everything out of the way. 
And then I'll catch up on chat, I promise. Thank you guys for all the wonderful chatting messages. You guys are hyped today. I think that's what the kids say. Let's see if I can bring this one over here. Yeah. Winning. All right, we're gonna go on a journey, guys. Gonna go on a journey. We'll see what happens here. Don't fall. Hold on. You can sit on the snowblower. That'd be a pretty far away vantage vantage point. Ugh. All right, let's unplug this. All right, I'm sorry you guys had to witness that, but I haven't developed um, the ability to levitate things. All right, let's see. That's a good angle. That is a great angle. Oh, let's get this out of the way. All right, almost had it. All right. We forgot to put some salsa on here though. Let's see, let's see how your vantage point is here. All right, I'm gonna try to wa watch chat here. So I wanna catch up for the next bite. No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat a huge bite first because it's gonna take me a long time to chew. Then I'll read chat. Read with my mouth full, seems good. Oh my God, bless America. What did I get myself into? Freedom, that's what. Hey, Call Me Man is here. How you doing, buddy? Summer free, secret hit would be really tough online. It seems like it'd be a really tough game to convince the Germans to play, too. So I've been trying to look up ASMR. What is that? Like, that seems like to be a term I should probably know the name of, or know what that means. Yeah, there's a lot of people that do Jackbox. I have not done that. Mmm. All right, almost almost caught up, guys. You guys are blowing me up. It's awesome. <laughs> Use your words. <laughs> I love that term. Just came home from volunteering. What did you do for volunteering? That's awesome, man. Nice work. Okay. Ba, 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 ba. Oh, Tapatio is pretty good. You're, that's a good call. I don't have any, I don't think, left. I did used to have that. It's when they whisper and make noises and stuff for relaxation. That's what I, I read. I looked that up this morning too because everybody's been talking about it. I'm like, I need to be in the know. Brush the microphone with a feather. Autonomous sensory meridian response. Thank you. Oh, that's the name of the game. That's hilarious. Well, we're, we got to play that. We're using. We're playing that game first. I, that's my vote. That's a common joke I have. So I'm looking at my other screen. So there's my um, the gateway to my basement. I should do a, I don't know if it'd be very good. I could do a, I need to do a home tour sometime. Probably I should clean the house though. So that might not be for a while. We'll see. 50, maybe 50 subs. If we get 50 subs, I'll clean my house guys. Could be months. Volunteering, so Manu is volunteering for the paramedics to teach us stuff about first aid. And when they have time, need 249 hours to be able to join them in missions. That's awesome, man. I'm first aid certified. I got CPA first aid certified a couple years ago because I thought I was going to be a CrossFit coach or, or try to do that. Um, but didn't end up doing that, but still, I like, keep re up in the skill because it seems like a good thing to have. Um, although I do get queasy around blood and stuff, so i probably be, probably would need saving if I needed to save somebody. Hmm. Pretty good. You guys haven't even touched any of it. Seriously, this is kind of insulting, guys. Mmm. Here we go. 
Oh, so good. Ta-da! Hey, hey Yum Pickles! Craig has them. There you go. Thank you, buddy. Thank you for the 201 bits, man. You are the new leader. <laughs> I think that 201 bits was uh, deliberate. Thank you so much, bud. I appreciate it. Uh, yeah, that's all. Uh, let's see here. Let me catch it. Do, do, do. There's hype. Thank you for the hype. ODK. That's awesome of you. Love hype. So what usually happens is I take so long to eat that, like, just to talk with you guys and eat, it's, which is a good thing. So I'm still going to try to scarf you on a second one. I don't even care uh, what happens. Well, you deserve the best regards. Thank you so much, buddy. I mean, that's really nice of you to say, man. Cheers, buddy. Mmm. So we have like we've lost enough from this burrito to make another burrito. Yeah, I mean it'd be kind of cool, like you said, Evan, to be a doctor, maybe save some lives or help some people out. But yeah, the blood. Like I, I cut myself. I don't know if you can can't really see it really well, but like right in the middle of there. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Cut myself with a knife, just using terrible cutting techniques, and this thing was open. I got really lucky; I didn't cut too deep, but I was bleeding pretty good. And I called nine one one. My girlfriend at the time was at the park, so she wasn't she wasn't able to come. And like they got here, and I was like having trouble. Like, I mean, it could have been just the blood loss too, but I was like, I had to sit down, and they came. I'm mean, fortunate; I live like two minutes away from the fire department where they came and wrapped up my hand and I drove to the um, to the urgent care which ran out of sutures to stitch me up so I had to go to the ER so that was a, that was quite a long night yeah that's awesome the first aid lessons are valuable to have I might need them here pretty soon if I keep too big of a bite knock on wood also, occupying your team with useful stuff, nice, or useful uh, time, nice. Mm. Sir Owen, you're back, man. How you doing, man? We're just eating some breakfast. Um, about six hours later than I usually do. But it's all good. It's because it's fun day Saturday. Um, so this is good. I should probably give some commentary on this. Um, the gluten-free um, tortillas aren't too bad. You kind of see there. This one's pretty crispy around there, but usually gluten-free things seem to be a little bit chewier, a little bit more dense. This isn't too bad. It's it's about right. I do kind of like the gluten-full or gluten-filled uh, tortillas too. They're just so soft and sticky and gooey, but you know this maybe be healthier. Um, potatoes good, sausage is good. I think it's a pretty good mix of everything. Um, salsa is good. Yeah, it's just good. I know that's really that's really in depth commentary, guys. Really in depth. <laughs> Got some tea. That's cold. So we'll uh, we'll nuke that really quick. Hmm. Excuse me. Let me just move this trophy out of the way. Um, and we need to grab that. Commentary, it's good. Check. Check and mate. All right, let's go ahead and work on making our second burrito. We're going to actually try from the uh, leftovers. Let's use a spatula like a human being here. So I do actually want to like show off my burrito making skills. But that requires having such little amounts of filling. All right, this is like a five-year-old over here trying to do stuff. All right, boom. We still have some that I missed in the pan. Yep, that's that's what a normal burrito 
filling should be like. Still good, still good. Uh, let's see. We don't have much for hash browns on there, so we're gonna do that. Or any lechis. Ooh, going shopping, you'll be cooking dinner, I bet. Did you hear some beep beep jerks? Another Tinder alert. <laughs> yeah, I don't know about that. Uh, I don't know what that is. It might be Discord. So I need to remember to probably just put my phone on just straight silent, probably. Maybe that will help. Mm, we didn't put any of that on there. Oh, so good. So good. Maybe I'll even microwave this because everything's a little on the coldish side. Yeah, this is a little bit packed, but maybe we can do something with this. Maybe not. We'll just eat it out of here. It's a bowl now. This is now a bowl. Mmm. You decided which game to play? Between two cities? Sounds good. I have the, uh, if we ever do a, a in-person pizza party, I have the card game for Oregon Trail. Although you might already have that too. Um, what, uh, what are you going to cook tonight, Manu? I actually did have a food blog. That's awesome, Pickles. It was just a minor one that I just made on the, whatever the Google thing is. Um, I did one for a little while. Uh, I just did local foods in my city, local restaurants. And then as I kind of started eating healthier and eating more paleo, I made it a little bit more about cooking too. All right. Mm hmm Salsa. Uh, we'll put that on after the microwave. Oh, jeez, what a good day, guys. You guys are hanging out, being awesome. Hit the 25 sub mark yesterday. Cheers to that. Cheers to you guys, actually, for supporting me. It's just so awesome. So awesome, guys. Can't tell you how, how cool it is. Some rice with apples, wow. That's, I think I've had, I don't know if I've ever had that before. That would be good though. Or you, especially if you like you cook the apples, that'd be good. Your microwave the teddy bear until it catches on fire. Uh, next stream, maybe, maybe 50 subs will do that. No, that's a terrible idea. I actually think my microwave might be on the last leg anyways. Do. Yeah, Bronx carried us really hard, man. Huge guys, if you see Bronx, give him a high five. Give him a high five. So hard, man. Well, Bronx has been like just carrying lots of channels. Like I looked at, I think on Slissa, he's donated 421, I think, of. Uh, uh, just donation alone. I know I've seen him gift subs before. No, Discord notifications. Boom. Well, there you go. And you tested it. So, all right. I'm going to try to do the burrito thing here. It's going to be close. We're going to be cutting it close here. So, if I remember correctly, you do, you kind of squeeze this in like this. Then you're going to fold all the way over. Just tuck it in like you're tucking in your kid for the night. And then, boom. Burrito life. Except we forgot to put the salsa on, so we're gonna we're gonna do this a second time. Not that we have a lot of room for salsa though. Oh boy, that might have that might have put us over the edge, guys. Do the freedom fold, yes, exactly. Oh, oh. do we have enough freedom here? Oh, come on, come on, get, let's go. Oh man, we got we lost a few men in the the freedom fold war, but they will be remembered. <laughs> Ooh, man, this is really grainy feeling on the outside. All right, prepare for this explosion, guys. Mmm. That is one hefty burrito. <laughs> That's right, we lost the battle. We lost a few good men, but we won the war. We won the war on hunger, guys. Finally. We busted open on that end. We're getting attacked from all sides, guys. 
We're gonna need some. We're gonna need our shields. We're gonna need our shield diamonds. Guys, show your mighty right shield diamonds to defend us from the salsa attack. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, so good. This is probably my best idea ever. Here we go. Thank you, Evan. We must defend this house. I didn't... I saw a hunter card most recently, but I think that was last night. Definitely tell me tell me what it is. I, I don't know if I'll be able to look at the link real easy. I guess you could still send the link, though. Hey, see a young pickles if you're going to grab some food. I, 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 there we go. There's all the shields coming in. Like I said, it's technically a shield, but, you know, it looks more like a diamond, so... You know, should probably make a shield. You need food? All right. I mean, make yourself a burrito then, I guess. Or call... McDonald's doesn't deliver, right? Yeah, I would do that then. Call... Get a pizza, probably. <laughs> hey, there we go. I love it. Defending... Defending our house, guys. I love it. Mmm. I saw the Hunter card though. I think it came out last night. I just saw it this morning. So it was had the Worgen mechanic where I think I'm a three mana two five, which is overstatted, which is a good, decent stat line. The two, the two is weird. You'd usually want like a three four spider tank build, but should be survivable. But then it, every turn it flips, and so it'll flip from a five two to a two five. Um, I mean it's kind of cool for Rexar to smart. And does it have? I can't remember. Did it have stealth also? Uh, yeah, Uber Eats isn't delivered to my area. Um, I thought about trying to use them to get some pizza yesterday, but they don't deliver to my area. So, because I just got like a, I think they're relatively still new here. Excuse me. And um, I think they had like some special where you get free delivery. Ooh, excuse me. Heart attack, guys. Um, you know, Kaka says, which would grizzle? It's a taunt, battle cry, lose one health for each card in your opposing hand. It's a 312. What uh what cost is that? I would guess maybe a five a five drop. Oh, and then the witching hour druid spell. Summon a random friendly beast that died this game. Interesting. They really seem to be kind of going into the... Uh, oh, it was 5-man. Okay. How about the spell? I bet that's probably... I'm guessing that's a 4 or a 6, maybe? We're losing the war, guys. It's getting close here. Smash it back in there. 3-man. Okay. I still don't feel like the odd even is really going to be great, I don't think. I mean, I, I think it'll be worth it for Warrior and then maybe possibly for Priest. Just like m most of the hero powers aren't that amazing in my opinion to have such a sacrifice. And I just don't think that Blizzard's been preparing for this type of mechanic. So you're just going to have really good cards that maybe you kind of wish, oh, I wish this was a 5 drop instead of a 6 so you could play this with this. So, but maybe eventually over the next year and a half, I mean, they're going to be around for two years. It'll be kind of a thing. Mm. So, let's see. I'll be done in about 10 minutes with this stream. What do you guys think? Do you think I, I mean, obviously if you guys need to go do other stuff, it's all good. But, could play a little Fortnite. Could play a little Hearthstone. Um, if you guys are mostly going to do something else, maybe I'll not stream and maybe just play some Fortnite off stream. Um, so Hearthstone, Dungreen, Fortnite, or anything else. We can just talk too. I like to talk. I don't have any, um, I don't know, compelling things to talk about other than this burrito. And you, you saw my, my critiques on it. It's good. Mmm. And I meant to. It's good. So I think I just have to take like a quick five minute break in between streams. 
and uh, set up a game. Oh, you have a paper to write. Oh, thank you, Ash. That's really sweet of you to say that you'd listen. I don't want to distract you too much. What, uh, what are you writing your paper on? I do not miss writing papers from back in high school and college. I need to have to do them in my MBA program. I actually thought about playing Fortnite. So, jerks, if you wanted, we could do um, do some duos if you wanted. Um, I just haven't played much. And we played a lot of Hearthstone last night. I know this crew is a little bit more Hearthstone-oriented, but... It's the last day of the season. If I played, I'd probably play a little bit more Murloc Paladin. We are just two wins away from 500, though. Got to get good with mouse and keyboard. I know, that's what I've been telling myself, too, but... It just hurts my wrist too much. Like, just the way that I, my... Uh, my chair sits, like the handles hit my uh, pull-out keyboard thing, so then I, I have to like, you know, use the mouse out to here, which just puts more tension on your elbow and, and wrist, and I notice those things too because they affect me a lot in the gym. I do lots of mobility work to, um, you know, work on my elbow, wrist, I've had, you know, several wrist kind of dingy injuries and then shoulders and everything's kind of dinged up. Group paper on marketing management. I have to uh, write the threats part of the SWOT analysis. One to two pages. That's not too bad. We let's write. Let's write Ash's paper for it too. Let's help. Hopefully, you don't need sources. You can just source jerks. He knows everything. I mean, what threats do we have for IBM guys? I mean, certainly other other companies, other computer companies. I mean, mobile. I mean, I could certainly be. Oh, I have an article to base it off, so you don't need you don't need our uh, our fake news or our fake facts. <laughs> Jerks, not the CEO of IBM. You cannot speak on behalf of them. This was a success, guys. So, I still have quite a bit left, naturally, because I made two pounds, two bags, uh, sausage, and hash browns, respectively. Yeah, we'll figure it out. Might just eat it skillet style. Mm. Guys, you really should have tasted that. It's so good. Oh, that's hot. That is hot. <clears throat> Eight-hour drive, FY. All right, there you go. Well, did you just look up to Iowa, too? Because I'm in the middle of Iowa. <laughs> so if you're eight hours to the border, you still have another three hours to go. <laughs> I mean, it'll not be warm by then, but we can. We have technology to make it warm. Let me make sure. I'll be right back here. Let me make sure that I have all the updates for Fortnite, too.
<laughs> All right, I'm back. Sorry about that. Had to go to the restroom too. Too much, like I said, way too much tea, tea today. All right, let's see. We're talking about tofu here. So if I wanted to make breakfast burrito without meat, what'd you put in there? Yeah, probably tofu. I mean, eggs are a protein too. Um, so I mean, sometimes hash, hash browns are good enough. You could do refried beans or beans. I saw somebody mention. Uh, I don't. I don't eat beans for me, just because you know it's not on the paleo diet. And actually, beans do kind of mess with my stomach. I mean, they kind of. Everybody says that they mess with your stomach, but I think that's actually not, you know, an ideal situation. So I like when I have black beans. It just I don't feel great afterwards. So I kind of cut those out of my diet, I, and I love chili. So usually when I do chili, I do the just chili beans. So yeah, I mean you could do, I mean, I don't know, I'd probably do either eggs or, well, I haven't eaten a lot of tofu though, but eggs and tofu kind of have a similar consistency. Um, but you could probably try to do it. I don't, I, I'm not good at cooking tofu. You can season the tofu to make it taste like a meat, probably too. Keeps you regular, yeah, they definitely keep you regular, that's for sure. That is for sure. I mean, we still have a little bit of some drink left, so we can we can chat. Uh, might even eat a little bit more too. <clears throat> yep, definitely gonna do that. We'll grab a little bit more of the eggs. A little salt for you. And by salt, I mean cheese. Booyah, yeah, I clipped that. We'll microwave that. Probably instead of just doing my normal one and a half, two hour uh, cooking YouTube video, I should just have that. Just 10 second clip. People will watch it. They'll be like, pretty good, pretty good. I've had chickpeas a few times, um, not a lot, but yeah, I don't know, tofu, to yeah, I think those are good suggestions, tofu eggs, if you can make the tofu kind of taste like something, you know, like with meat or whatever, that'd probably be okay. Potatoes are always a good choice, so <clears throat> if you season the potatoes pretty well with eggs, Peppers would be really good. And then everything after that is just icing on the burrito. <clears throat> so <clears throat> this is not a burrito. This is now a skillet. <clears throat> it's, it's a lot probably, but it's fine. This is going to be, we might eat a little bit more later today, but just having a massive meal right now. <clears throat> so I might just eat this instead. I forgot I do have laundry I need to fold before I go over to my buddies. So I might actually stick with this instead of doing the games, unfortunately. I know I teased you and promised that, but that's probably okay. I know a lot of people don't like to watch Fortnite anyways, or, you know, more people are used to Hearthstone and stuff. So might might just finish the food and then probably call it a day. Because uh, I have a tendency to overstream or when I'm on stream and it's hard to get it's hard to go away from you guys You guys are too awesome. It's too awesome to it's like, you know, you go to a friend's house you're like, Oh my gosh, I was supposed to leave two hours ago It's pretty much what it is Yeah, a little bit of adulting to do before I go to my buddy's house um, if It's very unlikely I'll end up doing sneaking in a stream tonight because I think I'll probably get home later But tomorrow for sure I'll be streaming um, try to do a you know usual four to eight thirty four to eight ish. Mm. Forgot about salsa.
cakes earlier, bacon obviously. I mean that's obvious. Um, for those of you that eat meat, <clears throat> was it really? Oh man, we gotta give her a hard time. Or no, it was sabotage. That's who it was. It was sabotage. Salissa likes bacon. Sabotage doesn't like bacon. But I think he's. I think he eats meat. But I think that'll be the first. I talked to or met uh, that doesn't like bacon. Not judging it, just uh, pointing it out. The feed, it might be the feed. It did say like poor connection for a brief second, but it looks like it's good now. Sorry about that. I don't, I mean, I don't know why it'd be a bad connection because my house, I'm in my house, my router's like. 25 feet away through a couple walls, but just normal crap walls. Mm. This is probably a little too much extra, but we're going to do Hey, Ron, how you doing? You don't like bacon either? Oh, my goodness. And you're such a sweet woman, too. I mean, geez. Mmm. Get me full after this one. Gonna need a nap. That's right, instead of adulting, now it's nap time. I'm doing great. How how's your Saturday going, Run? Anything planned today? Bacon's pretty good. I mean I I will agree, people are going a little overboard with bacon, especially here in the Midwest. Like they just you know, it's almost kind of turning hipster where it's like, oh man, I'm baking up everything. And I mean, and, and I'll play along with that, but sometimes it gets a little crazy with uh, with people and the bacon. But good, lazy, good. That's the way it should be. <clears throat> I did a really intense workout, ate a lot of food. So I have a feeling I'm going to be pretty lazy the rest of the day, even though I did tell <clears throat> to use a nap over streaming. No, no, I probably will. I'm going to do, I rarely do nap, actually. Um, could do an IRL napping stream. Not a good idea. Um, but, no, I'll actually still fold laundry. I don't, I rarely ever nap, too. I don't think I'll actually nap as much as I probably could use a little bit of one. <clears throat> Seriously, you're killing me with those kitty emotes. You're literally killing me. It, you, you warned me in your name, but... You're so cute. So cute. Mm, this is... This is good. <sighs> I don't know. What, what should I cook for next time? Um... One of my buddies, he mentioned, like, he gave me a good idea. So there's this, uh, what I'd call sausage peppers. It's really like kielbasa sausage, though, not ground sausage. But you can do that, too. Um, used to make, like, a kielbasa and peppers recipe. Super easy. <laughs> might, might be a meal. Excuse me. I don't know why my title's not right on this screen. Ooh, waffles. Yeah, waffles sound good. Hey, efficiency, how you doing with the Bob Rossi mode? I love it. <laughs> Guys. We need our second win. We're only our third win. Did I mention the pizza last night was amazing? It was amazing. I definitely should have kept a couple, couple slices of it, uh, for 
today. I probably would have ate him before I work out, which might have made me sick too, but I, like, after I got done working out, I had not eaten at all, so I went and I grabbed an RX bar, which is like a, basically kind of like a Wara bar made of, like, raisin or dates and nuts and some other stuff. Two wins, Ash. Two wins away. Two wins away. I know I could probably jump on there to do that, but if I jump on there, I'm just going to keep hanging out with you guys because you're so freaking awesome. No, I didn't get it last night. I could have stayed up and got it, but I think I, um, I forgot to look at my record last night. Excuse me. <clears throat> I should have looked at my record last night. I don't know. I might have even had a winning record last night, even with Murak Pally. We did kind of switch up the deck. Just because you're used to playing in one certain specific way. Yeah, I know. I was thinking about I should do that today. But... I don't know. I knew I'd need to leave for my buddies in like an hour-ish. Hmm. I mean, you guys... You guys could talk me into it. I, I completely succumb into peer pressure. I mean, Ash is, Ash is trying to rip me on here. I mean, if you guys really cheer me on, I'll, I'll play Hearthstone or Fortnite. And get those last two, last two wins. Ooh, I gotta sneeze now. Ooh. Let's put hot liquids in her mouth. Hey, Odin, Odin Sword, how you doing? Go Hawks! Thank you for the follow, too. I've been meaning to message you. I saw you follow it, I think, when I was offline, or I missed it. So thank you, Odin. Go Hawks, indeed. I'm wearing my... Hawkeye colored shirt. What else do I have? That's Hawkeye. Hawkeye magnets. Hawkeye apron. Uh, lots of stuff in my living room. Do it, do it, do it. I love, I love the enthusiasm, Ash. Okay, we have a played Captain Claw. It's a cool 1999 game with the main character a cat. You've got you've got uh, DK's uh, attention already. Kitty Pocalypse. I mean that could be scary though. That could be kind of scary. I might have to wait until after the kiddo's asleep. Could you could scare them away from cats? So good to know nothing about American football. Hey, yeah, that's that's fair. <clears throat> Teach their own. I. Yeah, that's what I feared, DK, is uh, maybe having to shoot kittens. <clears throat> as many friends as possible. Sorry, I see the stream's kind of getting a little wonky, too. Um, it looks like right now it's, it's okay. But for whatever reason, it keeps having a bad connection, so I apologize for that. See. They'll shoot bad doggos. Okay, well. Oh my god, they're so cute. They're so cute. Who, who, who is Bing? Who is that uh, streamer? She have so many cute doggies and cats. <clears throat> it might not have been just you, Manu. Uh, I mean, hopefully you can hear me now. If you can't, let me know. Let me tight. Just in case. <clears throat> Scrubbing. Yeah, I'm sorry about the connection. I don't know why that's happening. I mean, it's usually running 30 frames per second. And then all of a sudden goes in and out. Okay. Well, that might be, that might be Destiny, Colin. Um, to probably end the stream. 
Uh, shoot. Trying to decide here. We'll go ahead and probably better end the stream for the day, unfortunately. I know some of you guys want me to keep streaming, and that would be pretty fun. Um, but, and I love hanging out with you guys, trust me. I would rather do that, but I do need to put all this food away, all like several pounds of it, and do some laundry, and maybe sneak in a nap or something like that. I have Mediacom. CenturyLink is, I had it before, but it was kind of pricey and janky. Um, but, I don't know, I thought about just threatening to quit, because I actually have a home phone. I'm that old that I have a home phone, but it's actually pretty useful for work. And, um, like, Mediacom's now up like $30 a month for a phone. And when I bought it, or when I had it originally, it was 5 bucks a month. Yeah, thank you guys so much for hanging out. I mean, this was an amazing stream. You guys are awesome, chatting it up, hanging out. Um, like I said, we hit the 25 subs yesterday, which was huge. Very, very small chance I'd stream tonight, unless I leave my friends early. But more than likely, I'll kind of hang out with them and be social uh, with the real-life people. Just getting old Nokia. Oh, my God. <laughs> that would be some interesting uh some video game or video on the on the Nokia. Awesome. Thanks again for hanging out with me today. Uh we'll probably cook again next Saturday. Uh maybe around the same time or maybe a little bit later. Um just check the schedule. I'll post that on Twitter tomorrow. Play either Hearthstone or Fortnite tomorrow. Uh new season, so if I play Hearthstone we'll play fun decks. Uh, but with that, thank you guys so much. I love you guys. Peace and love. Have a good rest of the Saturday. We'll talk to you later.